Hey everyone, this is Matt Young with the Casper Mountain Biathlon Club here at day two of the first annual Spring Nordic Fest here in Casper, Wyoming. Checking out the trails right now and warming up before the team relay. So far all the trails are looking pretty good right now. All thanks to head coach Rob Rosser who was up early this morning grooming for all of us. How's it going, Olaf? Good. Right. How's it going, man? Pretty good. How are you feeling this morning? You know, it's always a good day to be out on the snow. The snow's in great condition. Like I said before, it's April and we're skiing. Gotta love it, huh? 80 degrees in Memphis. One, two, three. Beautiful. Woo! Yeah, thank you. We got Kathy Rosser and Naomi Hernandez here. Go team! How are y'all feeling this morning? Good. Snow feels good. Are y'all ready? Yep. The goal is to survive for me. <laughs> Second race ever. <laughs> I'm so proud of her. What's the team name? Uh, fasting female. <laughs> <laughs> I got the well. Never mind. <laughs> cool. Well, good out. Good luck out there. Thanks for your time. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> Thanks. So far, the snow conditions are looking really good, and looking forward to racing with everyone else. Thanks. What's going on, Ed? Oh, just uh, enjoying the snow. What are you thinking of the snow so far? Looking good. Yeah. Here I am with my teammate Ed Berg, uh, number 71. I'm number 72. We're both looking forward to the sprint relay in a couple of minutes. Um, look forward to racing with everyone. Get up to speed. Get moving a little bit. Let them tag. As soon as you tag, you can start floating. So body to body. Neutralize. Okay, this is neutral. This is not neutral, this is dangerous. We're gonna stab someone in the face, okay? So after you tag, just be neutral. And then you can look around and if it's clear, you can jump off the trail, right? Where is the, the threshold in terms of where you can tag? So see the perpendicular? Okay, to so there. Tag within that okay. range. You should always try to tag right smack in the middle of the range. If you get too close to either end, you're, uh, you're asking for trouble. Uh, thank you. Uh, you, you got the one. You are? Thank you. How do you feel about racing today, Kelly? Uh, thrilled, man. Father, daughter. What a day to be out. Not bad. Right. Gotta do it. How are you feeling today? Pretty good. Uh huh. You and your sister tag teaming it? Yeah. Who's gonna be faster? Me. Uh huh. Why are you shaking your head now? We'll see what the results no, say. No, I did you yesterday. How are you feeling today? You ready to race? Yeah. Who's your racing partner? Uh, Justin Brooks or somebody. I don't know who it is. Uh, he's 82 over there with the orange head. I guess he knew that. Yeah. Matt? Hey, what's going on? How are you feeling today? Pretty good. What are you racing today? Well, we're here at the uh, Sprint Relay. How far is it? I believe it's two loops each, 1.5k. Uh huh. Have you ever done a relay race? I haven't. It's my first time, so I'm really looking forward to it. What do you think about the rules of the tag off? I thought it was pretty fair. Makes sense. You know it's a mess start? What's that? Is it a mess start? I believe so. Ten seconds to go. The Casper Mountain Biathlon.
How does it feel to have finished your first race in a long um, time? I feel good to have finished. <laughs> and I didn't stop the whole way, so. Even better. That's a, an accomplishment for me. <laughs> I love it, I love it. She was ahead of me on the first run until then. That hill really kills people. It's good for you. It's like eating your Wheaties. So how'd you guys feel about your race? Um, slow. Slow? Thought it was a little icy outside today. Yeah. Uh-huh. It's good for you. Uh-huh. Do you like racing with your dad? Yeah. Yeah, it's good. Did your mom get some good pictures? Just finished up with the sprint relay. Uh, now looking forward to the 20K coming up in a couple minutes. You know, I will come out there and carry you back. You don't want to. As long as I can keep a decent pace, we should probably stick together for most of that 10K. It's, it's pretty well signed. We are finishing up from over here. But at least for the first 5K, stick with me. Okay? All right? Are you okay? And then, like, yeah, what we're gonna do is we're gonna start out here, okay? We're gonna do the eastern side trail. Then we come in, which is gonna be the top trail up above there, like we did a couple days ago together. We're gonna come in and go behind the biathlon targets, okay? And then we're gonna go straight through. We're trying to set up a, a table of water right over here, because we're gonna go by that point every five k's okay we, we will essentially go by the time attack we're going to give us splits and stuff every five k's so that's kind of why we we're running it that way okay um and then once we get there after the first loop so essentially the first five k ends right over there close to the finish but on this side of it we are going to cut across, we're going to take a 90 degree of turn, then we're going to go to the western side. We're going to do the 5k on the western side. When we return, we will come up this short little steep that you guys are going down just a couple minutes ago, okay? We will come up by the container. We won't go into the finish. We will come into the bypass lane, it'll say lap, okay? and then we will go out for another eastern course. But that time, instead of starting here to go out on the east, we're gonna go over that bridge and head on out, okay? All right, and then the second time when we come in in the west, we'll go into the finish, okay? Everyone's got it, right? You know <laughs> Clear as mud. <laughs> Follow Rob the first lap. So yeah, I mean, a, so we'll call it a 10K lap, right? <laughs> so, and it is, it's either V boarded or it's got the pink, uh, well, Wait, pin flags um, on intersections. So there's either pin flags or V board on the intersections, okay? Don't cross those. Yeah. And the other thing is, when in doubt and you're looking to the right, if it's not uh, V boarded enough for you and it's not groomed, don't go there. Yeah, so only fresh groom, okay? Right. Matt, are you going to play that during, during the race? A little bit. He's in with me, so... <laughs> <laughs> Woo! <laughs> <laughs> All these amazing volunteers and spectators here this morning. Last pit stop before the last 5k. We're almost there. Just finished up 20k with Olaf Schultz. Uh, he finished just a little bit ahead of me. I was right behind him. Uh, we're both feeling pretty good. Definitely a pretty 
good course out there. Oh, there's a couple of slushy spots. Olaf, how are you feeling now? Feel good. Longest, longest ski ever. So I'll take it. How are the conditions out there? The last 5K were a little sketchy. It fell about four times. How so? Uh, the snow was melting. It's pretty sticky, and then it was icy in other places where it hadn't melted. So. Well, great job out there. It was fun. Considering it was your biggest and longest ski race out there. I appreciate it. People do that. Yeah, we're gonna do Sweet. Oh no way. And we got a appetizer for something else. Thanks for your time, Olaf. Thank you. Man. Great job out there. All right. Nice man. Second place. Myself, Rob Rosser, 102, 27, first place. Adam St. Pierre, second overall, 56, 53. Let's go jump up on the podium. There we go. Let's get rid of it. Perfect. Time 137, Rory Anthony. Jump over to U16 boys. Third place, Sam Brooks, and the time was 107.43. Senior men, third place, Jamie Mothersbach, kind of like a one two fifty one. Second place. From Randy, in a time of one hour and four seconds, Mason Vincent. And first place for senior men, and first place overall, just a couple seconds in front of Adam St. Pierre, in a time of 56.50. In his third year of Nordic team, Adam Farbaugh. Just back from Bathroom Nationals in Vermont last weekend. Adam from Boulder. Good job, guys. Thank you all for this uh, experimental weekend. Next year, we will have many more teams. That is our goal. So yeah, we're too brave about that. Guys, you got to roll. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. I found this boat on the sky.
Good job, make sure you get through. Oh, I still got mine. And Kevin may still have it. Good job, Ed. Good job, thanks, How'd you feel out there? Awesome. It was a totally challenging course. Got it done. Awesome. Great job out there, Ed. Thanks, man. Brian, how was the course this morning? I loved it. I love it. It's always great here at Casper. How are you feeling? I feel good. It wasn't too bad. I didn't go hard, though, know, either. So I took it easy. I liked it. You had some pretty good competition out there with Kevin Burton's side. Along, oh, yeah. Alongside you. It's always nice to have competition. It's For sure. Hard sometimes to find it. Great job out there, Brian. Thanks for your time. Thanks, Matt. Day two of the 2019 first annual Spring Nordic Fest is a wrap here at the Casper Mountain Outdoor Center in Casper, Wyoming. We just finished up the, the 20K uh, and congratulated our last athletes that came in. Ed Berg, way to go, Ed. Great job out there. Uh, looking forward to more events here at the Castle Mountain Outdoor Center this upcoming spring and summer, and of course the winter as well. Hope to see you all out there. Thanks. Heading into the Gruner building. Got to change out of the boots and take Olaf back to the airport. <laughs> This is it everyone, uh, dropping off Olaf at the Ramcota Hotel before uh, he heads uh, to the airport for his flight. We hate to see him leave, but we appreciate him coming back to Casper uh, a couple times this season. Ramcota. <laughs> this is it everyone, Olaf is now leaving us. We hate to see him go. What was your biggest takeaway from this weekend? It's all about pacing. <laughs> I think uh, just the community is fantastic, right? So that's the part I appreciate the most. We definitely appreciate your support coming from out of state. Well, thanks, thanks. Glad to be a part of it. For sure. Glad you're Take able care. to make it out here. <laughs>